Gucci, Gucci, Louis, Louis, Fendi, Fendi, Prada. Them basic something, something, they don't even bother. I can't remember who that was. Krishan? That was like a really old song. Maybe 2000 and like two? Nah, I was in the second grade. That's not possible. Anyway, welcome back to my channel, everyone. I made a Gucci video reviewing my Gucci Dionysus bag. Don't know what happened to it got deleted. So I'm here to re-review the bag. I've had it for about two months now. My favorite bag, I wear it every single day. Some people will say, why spend that much money on a purse? I say it's worth it, I think it's an investment. I also work hard. So I'm gonna justify this outrageous purchase and say I deserve it. Some of you may say, how do you know what you deserve? I'm not even gonna entertain that question. No, but on a real note though, I really do love this bag. I wear it every single day. This is the pebbled black um, leather Gucci emblem on the back. You may not be able to see, there you go. Um, the chains are perfect. I'm telling you, I wear this with every single outfit. See, it even looks good with this. It's the perfect size. You would think it's too small, but this is the medium size. It's not the large. Inside, it's the perfect amount of space. I keep my small leather good inside. I keep my checkbook. I don't know what this is, but now I'm throwing it to the side. In the zipper, there's a lot of room there as well. And in the front, I have my business cards in this little Cuba thing my friend got me. I have a charger, I have lotion, because some people really be ashy, including me. You can't leave the house without lotion. I don't know how people do it. And in LA, you can't go downtown without sanitizer. <laughs> you can't go anywhere without sanitizer. Airport or chapstick and some other small items. But overall, I always used to carry a big bag, a huge tote. And I think for the most part, it was because I was in school and I carried my laptop everywhere. But now my company computer is a laptop, so I carry that around more. Um, and I just, I just, after using this bag, I don't feel the need to have a really big bag. Obviously, I keep my keys inside as well. Um, and that's pretty much it, but my phone fits too, right in the middle. My phone fits and it just, there's a little latch on the side to open it up. This, I think there's hair ties in here. I don't know what's in here. Oh, the Gucci, um, The Gucci cards of responsibilities. And then I, oh, I have this little like note card in here. That has nothing to do with the bag, but I like to put good affirmations out into the world. It's still clean. Uh, I can't, I really can't complain. This is my favorite bag. Again, I wear it every single day. The Swarovski crystals on the front with the emblem are an excellent touch. It sparkles wherever it is. It still smells like leather. Yes. So I would totally recommend someone getting that bag. If you really want to treat yourself, I say it's worth the investment as long as you're going to wear it often or even if you aren't going to wear it often, whatever. Um, it came in the Gucci dust bag. It was felt like silk, satin, whatever it was, but it's it's just a great bag and I would totally recommend it. This was a short video, but I just wanted to remake it just in case anyone wants to know what the bag look or feels like, or if I regret my purchase, I don't at all. Some of these review videos that I've seen online, like when I wanted to buy it, there wasn't enough information. I didn't know if it was too big, if it was too small, what could really fit in there. I'm telling you, it's a good sized bag. It's a great sized purse. You can fit a lot of things in here. That is all I have for you guys. Thank you so much for watching. As usual, check back for new YouTube videos and subscribe to my channel. Have a great day, guys.